One of the most exciting traditions in college football. Be ready to cheer on your Bearcat marching band as they enter the stadium and fly down the steps. Ladies and gentlemen, we present the 270 member University of Cincinnati Bearcat Marching Band. I'm Natalie Ackman. I'm a two-time alumna of the university, now post-grad. I am the president of UC's alumni band, and I am the author of its first history, Thy Loyal Children, a history of the University of Cincinnati Bearcat Bands. So the charge was invented by band director Roy Robert Horniak in his very first year as director in 1954. He kind of wanted uh, a big splash in his first year and devised this idea of the students running down the steps into the stadium right into their pregame performance. It was a very popular tradition and one that has survived for 70 years now. So the reason that the charge down the steps is so unique, A, is because Nippert Stadium is one of the only stadiums in college football in which you have direct field access. So this wouldn't be able to happen if you didn't have direct field access. But B, the reason why it's so difficult to do is because the elevation of Nippert Stadium steps changes as you go down them. So you start from really tall steps and then go to very shallow short steps to then very long deep steps. From there, there's only been a two year period in history where the band has not done the charge. Uh, in 1977, uh, there was a new director, Glenn Richter, and he was very concerned about the liability of running down the stairs into the stadium. So he had to deal with the students and said, if anybody falls down these steps, we're not doing it anymore. That very first game, a bass drummer fell, smacked their head against their drum, had to go to the hospital, get stitches, and the charge was off for the rest of Richter's career. Now, he only spent two years at Cincinnati, so once he moved on and Dr. Milligan came on as director, uh, the students were very eager upon Milligan's arrival to ask if the charge could be brought back. Uh, Milligan had kind of the same terms that it could be brought back, the only major change happening is that the drum line would now start on the field and no longer do the charge with the rest of the students. So that's why the drum line is on the field and not up at the top with the rest. It wasn't originally called the charge. Uh, that came much later in its history. Uh, it was invented by our current announcer for the Bearcat bands, Randy Smith, uh, when he started in 2001. He's a big supporter of the band program and the voice of the Bearcat bands. So he decided that the charge should have a, a moniker of its very own, introduced that into his pregame script and the charge down the stadium steps took off. Thank you. 